brave souls? Both of them. Both. up everybody you know who it is Joel Hansen you're my good friend mr. Scott Watkins or Scott Heath so today we are on our way to Sylvan Lake Alberta to a place called open range saloon to do their behemoth burger challenge so this is an undefeated burger challenge consisting of four burger patties you then have what is two grilled cheese sandwiches with kind of like I don't know they call it like a big French garlic bread Texas toast style stuff you have two orders of fries, a big order of onion rings, you have two containers of gravy which you have to finish. You also have a 32 ounce beer or soda you have to finish, and two hot chicken fingers. Although, if you don't want the hot chicken fingers, like the spicy, you can have regular chicken fingers with a five minute deduction. So for the normal challenge, you, do, you have 30 minutes to complete it. For the non-spicy version, you have 25 minutes to complete it. I don't know which one we're gonna choose. We're gonna go talk to them about it. Should be good. So let's get at it. Open range saloon, here we come. All right, everyone, so here's that challenge. The behemoth is, is massive, lots of fries, lots of onion rings, um, quite a burger, lots of, we went with the spicy versions because you guys love spicy. Yes, yeah, so this is a spicy burger challenge. They have some crazy hot spicy, uh, I think it's like cheese sauce and then crazy hot spicy chicken fingers on the burger. It looks pretty good. Uh, it is, is undefeated. We do have to drink two gravies as well. And again, the pitcher of we went with Diet Coke. Undefeated, Scott, excited? Yeah, absolutely. I'm hungry. Uh, it smells great and uh, I can't wait to eat. That's all it is to do, get eating. All right, so here we are. We're gonna start. We have 30 minutes. So, got your time, Scott? Yeah, got the timer going. All right, got my friend Mr. Ketchup. You know I'm a big fan of ketchup. So that, I guess we'll start the count. Let's say five, four, three, two, one. Here we go. Thank you. Burgers. Mm -hmm. A lot of cheese on it. And a cheese sauce. Oh, that is spicy. Mm -hmm. Oh man, you're right. I wasn't expecting that. Hey everyone, Joel Hansen here. I'm here with my good friend, Mr. Scott, and we are at Open Range Saloon in Sylvan Lake, Alberta. So this is kind of in the Red Deer, Alberta area, um, most notably known for Sylvan Lake, which is a big lake. People go boating and swimming, etc., etc. So this is a really cool little quaint spot that had this undefeated burger challenge. So for this challenge, you had the big burger with like grilled cheeses and then the spicy chicken fingers, which were absolutely crazy. So as I mentioned, you can basically do the challenge with a 25 minute time limit if you exclude the spicy chicken fingers or you can do it with a 30 minute time limit if you have the spicy chicken fingers. I think there's a little bit of miscommunication because we were at least taught or told or led to believe that it was only a Frank's Red Hot Sauce on the spicy chicken fingers. So we're like, oh, that's not bad because we do like a normal level of spice. However, we very quickly found out that it was like chili paste and it was really hot. Interestingly enough, the queso cheese sauce, the cheese sauce was actually spicy. Um, not that we were something again we weren't really expecting. So it turned out to actually be like a relatively dang spicy undefeated burger challenge. Um, so pretty cool. We did have to finish again the beverages. We both went with the Diet Coke. You could have chosen an actual beer though. Um, so I mean, if you're gonna, well, you wanna drink beer with your challenge, it's actually probably a pretty cost-effective way to get a beer and a pretty relatively good sized meal. Um, again, the gravy is mandatory. But besides that, I mean, it's pretty straightforward. Some burgers, some onion rings, um, the fries. It was all very enjoyable. The staff were very, very nice as well. And just the overall environment of this challenge was really, really cool. It helped lend the experience. 
people were so excited that not only were we there trying the challenge, um, but one of the gentlemen in the back just randomly was there. He knew who we were, um, so he was pretty excited to see how it all turned out. And then especially as we progressed uh, through this challenge, people were like, oh my gosh, will they actually beat it? Because as we mentioned, it was undefeated for quite a while. Another thing I forgot to mention is a prize for this uh, challenge in addition to the free mail, a t-shirt, you also got a $25 gift card it was to like a local uh, kind of like costume store. So that was kind of also unique. Um, we didn't get to end up using it while we were in the area, but nonetheless. So I think that's pretty much all the information I have to share. Uh, but yeah, it was a good challenge. So let's see what all transpires. See if we can beat this undefeated challenge and let's go. All right. So got most like the patties done but I'm keeping the spicy chicken peas. Yeah. I'm going for the fries. Okay, so we're about five minutes in. We finished half of the burger, a little bit of onion rings. Joel's killing it as usual. So I just got the fries, onion rings, and then half of that uh, spicy, that's sort of the whole spicy chicken part of that. So.
about nine minutes in. Me and Scott are about the same. Just got the spicy chicken piece left. Okay guys, so we're 10 minutes in. Uh, I just got this spicy chicken to go. I think it, they said it was Frank's. This is not Frank's in my experience with Frank's. This is very spicy. So, I just got this left and Joel's just about finished there. He's gonna get the new record and I'll leave shortly behind. There's a whack of chili paste on it. Seconds. Scott's just finishing the gravy. Oh, that was spicy, man. Woo! That's chicken, those chicken thingy things. That is way like a lot of chili. Ah. I'm dying. Woo! Scott's finished there for this moment. Excuse me. Woo! Excuse me. Woo! Excuse me. I'm done. There we go. All right. Hi, everybody. So just finish that up. Officially, the challenge is defeated. So myself, somewhere around 12 something. Scott, about 13. Seriously, we both crushed it. Job, Scott. Thank you. The food was good overall. Yeah. Very, very spicy. I'm, my mouth is still kind of burning, <laughs> and I'm scared to touch my running nose because I don't want to spice my nose. But yeah, huge thanks to everybody here at Open Race Saloon. Really, really enjoyed it. Great staff, great food, great environment. So, everybody, till next time, stay happy, healthy, hungry. Don't do what we do. Maybe we'll get dessert. Of course, till next time, happy eating.
Hey everyone, Joel Hansen here with my good friend, Mr. Scott Eats. Oh, that is oh, fizzing. So anyway, we are uh, got a couple drinks before I go on the airplane, really close to the airport, and obviously I can't take these on. So I got some uh, black cherry soda, some Jones Zilch, so the calorie-free version. We're gonna try to double barrel this, so open one up. Scott just shook the sh crap out of his. That like These yeah. are probably gonna foam, so this may take a second. But uh, You guys uh, ever know when something's a bad idea yeah. and Joel convinces you to do it? That's one of these that times. So neither of us are like pro chuggers and I've only tried to double barrel something once or twice in my life and it's always went pretty bad. So Scott's very hesitant of it, but I mean, what's the worst case we spill on ourselves, right? <laughs> I think. <laughs> and I have a 10 hour drive home. Yeah, or we die. I gotta hop an airplane though, so. Yeah. Anyway, yeah, so we're just gonna drink and. Cheers. Try to double barrel this, so uh, I don't know. I. This could just be an absolute fail, but this will be a bonus video anyway. So yeah, let me let me close the door before uh... in case you get it all over. <laughs> all right, well, uh, cheers, everybody. Cheers. Let's do it, Scott. I, sorry, I stopped because I was thought Scott was about to spit on me, but that didn't work too bad. I'll try it again. I can't close my mouth around these bottles. I keep storming between. Mm. Mine was. That's got it. I can do one at a time. My mouth just ain't big enough. <laughs> what are you trying to say? You got a big, got a big mouth. Loud mouth. There you go, buddy. Little clip. YOLO. Soda pops. Tastes pretty Woo. good.